So THC, I right now I just don't think there's good evidence for. Although I'll come, well, I'll come back to it now in one of the two ways. If you look at some of those studies, though, and you've really got to kind of dig deep into them and look at all of the ancillary, the supplemental materials in the science paper, something funny happened when I was reading the literature. If you looked at they, they always classify people's level of sleep apnea in these sleep studies. It's just one of the things that we always measure, just like we measure your brain waves and we measure your sleep apnea. If you look across when people were dosed experimentally with THC, the sleep apnea started to decrease. And in some of those studies decreased statistically significantly, which would argue that THC may potentially be, have something beneficial to say about being at least an adjunct to sleep apnea therapy. 